Hi guys, in today's video, I'll be showing you as to how you can solve this game in your uh, desktop browser within a single attempt. So if you ever wondered how the game is actually reactive, for example, let me just, uh, you see how reactive it is. I click the button, the output appears really quickly on the screen. And the, whole, I mean, the uh, reason as to why it is so reactive is that uh, most of the application is actually running on your PC. It's not like uh, connecting somewhere behind the server. And if that's the case, uh, the solution must also be within, uh, that must be stored locally. Uh, I mean, you can obviously encrypt a solution to make sure that you don't know what the actual solution is, but if the person is lazy enough or to not take much care, you can find out uh, where he has stored it for. So to get to this tab, you can either click your F12 uh, function 12, key or you can just right click and click inspect post which you'll have to go to your applications tab and here you can find multiple uh, you know tabs so here you have to click your local storage and uh, the and the website's name here you can see that the solution is light so so if the solution is light Let's, we'll have to ensure it's light, right? So I'll just enter this solution and give it a try. So it is right. Yeah, not a genius, uh, but anyways. <clears throat> and you can already see I've tried it once. That's why I have, uh, I mean, two, uh, two, cons uh, two consecutive games with, uh, which I've solved within a single attempt. But yet again, there is no workaround for this 13 hours, right? So if you still want to play this game on a continuous basis, I've made one. Uh, this is my personal lap, right? Uh, this has no time constraint that you can play how many other times you want. And it also has additional settings in which you can control the number of attempts and uh, the number of letters. Uh, yeah. and. Unlike the Wordle game, the actual Wordle game, this one will not let you. I mean, I, I mean, this this will not help you in cheating. So, you can go to application, local storage. There is absolutely nothing, and you can even go to session storage. That will be nothing. So, so there is no way you can cheat in this game because this is connected to uh, the server. So every time you click the button, it goes back to the server to update the screen. So there is nothing stored on your uh, on your personal computer or a phone, apart from the statistics, of course. So because that is the only way I can keep track of when I mean, you can keep uh, track of your winnings, <clears throat> because you're not logging in anyways. No one's keeping track of your IP address or something. So uh, the best way to do go uh, go about uh, storing your individual statistics is like uh, placing a cookie in your browser, be it mobile phone or desktop. So yeah, I'm not going to be playing this game because it will take quite some time. It will take at least some five to 10 minutes. I'm not going to do it. Uh, but if you want to do it, you can do it on your own time and uh, do let me know if you like this app. I'm thinking of adding additional updates which I've uh, discussed in previous videos. So that'll be for this video.